I'm design star Doug Hines. You're watching ATO Profile. And I know what you're thinking. Man, he's got a really cool house, but I can't take credit for this. I'm Christopher Martin, and I'm actually at the IKEA Home Furnishings located in Atlantic Station in Atlanta, Georgia, on the ATL Profile. And we are here because interior designer Doug Hines is going to be the focus of HGTV's Season 6 premiere of Design Star. And we're going to talk to him about that accomplishment and find out why he is an important part to the world-class studio team. Don't go away. It's the ATL Profile, where you are always in stock. For all those who don't watch HGTV, tell everybody what the show's about, the premise, and what's going to be going on. Okay, well, Design Star, this is the sixth season of it, and this is the uh, season that everybody, all the designers are actual designers. In previous seasons, they've had people who were interested in interior design and dabbled, but this is the first season which really raised the bar for all of us, uh, competition-wise, that everybody was an actual interior designer, and that's what they did for a living. Um, so it's an elimination kind of show right. where, um, you know, their challenges and their, their various tasks that we have to perform that are design-related, and each week, somebody gets eliminated until it whittles down to the final contestant. What will let me know when I walk into somewhere, anywhere, mm -hmm. and say, you know what, I know Doug Hines designed that. I know that's his work. I mean, it's, it's one of my trademarks to have several wow factors. As because I specialize in restaurants, I, I really truly believe that when you walk into a restaurant or any room, it, it could even be a bedroom, that you have to have several things that you automatically go, oh wow, oh wow, oh wow. And so you keep looking, and it's a feast for the eyes that you always see things that really kind of hit you, and you, your eye just dances around the room, and you're impressed. So my style is really dramatic contemporary and I pair in a lot of vintage items in all of my projects. I always like using something old, whether it be a fan or old books or something old get, ties it to, to uh, gives it a sense of history. And so any restaurant or project or bedroom or residence, it needs when you walk in, it's just drama. It's not boring. Three seconds to impress somebody when they walk into a room. So if you don't say wow in three seconds, you fail. I'm going to teach you how you can have design in the palm of your hand. When you see somebody who's reaching their dreams, living out their passion, what does that make you think? There are so many opportunities out there, and it's great when someone gets to express their creativity and their passion for furnishings and design. So I'm really happy for Doug. Um, it's a, a happy moment for Atlanta right. to see an Atlantan be featured on such a great um, network, HGTV. So IKEA is happy to be affiliated with this experience, and we're happy to host the event here at the Atlanta store. I think he was awesome. Um, the bedroom that he did, how she said, he put the mirror, he put the, um, the wallpaper in the back and the mirror actually just kind of draws you in. I think that was awesome. He did a great job. I enjoyed the way he was able to execute, do everything that he needed to do to show the public that he is going to be a great, successful designer. I'm real proud of Doug. Doug and I have collaborated on a lot of projects together a lot of restaurants around town. Uh, we're in the process of doing an event space, world-class, metro, metroplex. So I'm just really, really proud of my partner. The penthouse we stayed in was $7.2 million. Oh, it was yeah. Six stories. Oh, wow. Yeah. wow. Amazing. Wow. The view, the sun would come in one side of the building and set on the other. The Statue of Liberty was on one side. The Empire State was on the other. It was amazing, wow. amazing. This guy is going to be an integral part of the World Class Studios family because he's going to be designing the World Class Studio Metroplex. I'm so happy to be on board with the ATL Profiles family and designing that Metroplex. It's a huge, huge space, and so it's a challenge for me because it's actually the biggest space I've ever designed. And I am going to incorporate a very contemporary, very modern feel so that you almost are transported to, you know, a... Uh, uh, another world, you know, and, and is separate from the location that it's in. Um, and it's just going to have just a very organic feel, you know, to the warehouse space, so it kind of lends itself to the exposed duct work and, and the big beams, but it has a very sleek, modern feel, something you might feel in, in midtown Manhattan, 
It's going to look good. And it's time we put the wraps on another edition of the ATL Profile. And again, congratulations to Doug Hines on this big night. Season 6 premiere of HGTV's Design Star. And I can't wait till we get the wow factor of his work at World Class Studios Metroplex. And he will link up what NX System and Designs to create one of the greatest sound systems, one of the great sound studios that you will see in all of the capital city. I am Christopher Martin for the ATL Profile, where you are always in style. Hi, I'm Walter Joy, partnering up with Doug Hines on our project World Class Studios Metroplex, and you're watching ATL Profile.